guys today we're taking a look at the media player preview for the xbox one now as part of the xbox preview program you can get this early if not you have to wait but this is the new media player app we've been waiting for this and it's available and uh right there it's showing uh i have the app up and it's showing my usb uh, flash drive now if you eventually is going to support network drives and things like that but right now it's just a flash drive and you can see already it showcases the photos uh, uh music as well as folders in there and i can go through photos quite easily and uh, i can definitely play uh, a track as you can hear so uh, it does a, a good job of easily jumping in and out of those things no issues there uh, so far i haven't had many issues with the application itself uh, but i can go in and also check out some of the different folders uh, like my youtube photo where i just have some of the youtube videos i've created and again it plays like uh, you know the xbox video player or even your netflix where you can fast forward and rewind with your trigger buttons and of course a is to jump in to play or pause you know, and, and again, it just looks very vibrant. Yeah, a sharp player, uh, great uh, video quality. Plays a host of codecs. Um, I'll have a list of the codecs uh, for you in the description. Uh, but it's a list of codecs. Yeah, we will even play MKVs. Um, you know, and I, I have a sample of MKV file. Uh, plus subtitles too. So, um, you know, you, it plays a lot of stuff. If you're a Toronto, you definitely love this um, all together. But I do like the fact that this update, uh, at least the preview, the media player preview really brings a lot to the table as an Xbox user. Now, in, part of that um, preview update, uh, a couple other things that came in earlier. Um, there is also the new one mini guide for one uh, uh, one guide, which I can't show you because I can't basically screen capture it. But you know, it's it's a new mini guide for for one guy, which is nice. Um, you can also go in and check out a couple of things. You, you do have a new devices and accessories section. Uh, shows you all your accessories that you have connected to the console, so including future wireless headsets and things like that. Uh, and also in your network section, you have a new bandwidth area, basically showcasing the amount of bandwidth your Xbox is using. So so far, I've used 51 gigabytes, 51.72 gigabytes in the space of about two weeks or so. So you do have that ability to check out what you're using, and you know just just just, just to see how you're handling the system altogether. We also know the updates to the friend feeds where you can go and compare, like, and also um, see what your friends are doing more streamlined. And you can follow me there, Thunder Emperor, with all threes instead of E. So if you guys have any questions or any comments, let me know. Don't forget to like this video, share this video, and favorite this video. Also, subscribe to the channel, top right hand corner of the screen. I love the application. I want to see expand, support uh, network stuff. But this is Thunder E saying thank you, and always enjoy your entertainment.